Good morning, happy Monday. Welcome back to the channel. My name's Lisa and as always, I'm super glad you're here with me today. What are we doing today? Well, we're going to try to move back into Savings Challenge Monday. We'll see how it goes. Um, we'll see how consistent I can be. So far, <laughs> it's been a struggle, but I think we're kind of back on track, but time will tell, right? All right, so we're going to start we're going to put the money to the side. I kind of have it divided up. So we're going to start with Savings Challenge Monday. This is a day of the week where you leave a like, 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 as Ange over in Budget and Debt would say, on this video. And then I give myself 25 cents for each like. And we just put the money in one of our binders. And we save up for whatever comes along. Hopefully we can, uh, it can be something fun. So... All right, so we had 90 likes on the very first video that I came back from my hiatus from, so we're gonna use that. 90, and that's great. Thank you so much, times 0.25 equals, I need a marker. It's been a minute. I need a decent pen or marker. And we're just gonna pick up where we left off. So we had 90, 90, and that is not very clear. <sighs> either is this but we're gonna go 90 and that is 2250 but we're gonna put in 25 because I don't have any singles and that's pretty cool so we have 5 10 15 20 25 dollars for show me the love and this challenge is from 40 plus life at Veronica and she's having a half price sale at her Etsy store until the end of July so I have most of her challenges I don't think I need any more I, I look though I did look and we're just look at that it was designated for medical it'll probably still be for medical we'll try to get a thousand dollars in there again so we'll just leave that there and we'll come back to this binder not today but that was fun yay I'm kind of excited about that <sighs> That was really good actually all right so this hundred envelope challenge I'd like to get this done and then work on another challenge I tend to spread things out too much and um, have too many things going so let's see what we have here we have five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen nineteen twenty 122 23 dollars will go in this challenge so we're going to mark these out oh, is this purple no oh. we're going to use red i'm going to use this five put this here and then we're going to start clearing out some rows if we can and see how many envelopes we can get shed of when this is done this will be 348 dollars whoops I've done this once before and I finished it quite quickly because I was on a mission. This we started the day after Christmas and we'll see. All right, so let's see. We'll go across. We'll use, we'll do the two and the four here. One, two, whoops. I'm not saving L bucks anymore. I, I just haven't had the time and um, well, my husband hasn't been in church since he's been sick, so that was our biggest source of L bucks. And mostly now, I'm I don't carry a lot of cash. Maybe I should because groceries are off the chain. One, two, three, four. How's your grocery shopping? I mean, it's a struggle. I'm so I'm not surprised with oh an I buck. You know how rare those are here in Florida. Very well. There you go. It's going in. I used to do the alphabet buck savings challenge, but I'm going to try to finish this one and whittle them whittle them down as they say put that four there uh, what were we talking about groceries groceries unbelievable well, we'll do this four and get this one done too one two three four we are tracking seriously tracking I kind of tracked before I thought I was doing good tracking I really wasn't I would start out really well on the first two weeks like oh I got this I'm keeping all the receipts and blah 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 no no this month July we have spent and I'll go over that at the end of in the beginning of August because it's a real eye-opener for us as two people 
like it's shocking. One and a four. Let's do that. No, let's do this bottom one too. Let's get this over with. But this is um, at Mandy's budgeting check budgeting items. So she has a fun YouTube channel and Etsy store shop that you can pick this up at. And um, these envelopes you can find on Etsy, or you can make your own. You know, you don't really need the envelopes. I just I have a lot of uh, cash stuffing stuff, so probably a good idea to use it. But we were going with this one, right? Jeez. One, two, three. Okay. Yes, we were. Oops. Got a little excited. Two, three, three. So we're getting, we're making progress. We still have a long way to go. So um, maybe September we can get this done and then we'll put this allegedly in the car down payment. We'll see. I just like having the cash here. I know some people are not big on having cash on hand. I'm okay with it. It's secure. Or put it someplace and I forget where it is and then definitely it's secure. So there's, there's that. Do you do that? Yeah, I do that a lot. So... But this I don't misplace. And it's all secure. And if anybody could find it, then good for them. Okay. It's not that much anyway. Next. Oh, that felt pretty good. We have one, two, three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Seventeen more envelopes to go. With a lot of four dollars. So we have a lot of fours to get rid of. So we'll work on that. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we have I find $25. And then we could knock those out. So that'd be good. That's exciting. Okay, next. Hold on, don't go anywhere. I'm not done yet. We we'll have some cash. Whoop. We have some cash here. And then we have this little binder. You remember this binder, right? Oop, too close, sorry. Figuring out my retirement. Uh, Renee made this for me. Uh-oh, can't remember the challenge, but you know who Renee is, right? Can't remember her channel. <sighs> it's been a while. All right, so this is my holiday binder, and there's been several holidays that have gone by that um, I never spent the money for. I, I kept it in here. I, I was just oblivious. Not oblivious, I was busy. Let's just say it the right way. I was busy, and I'm trying to catch up. Oh, it is today, the 26th. And I'm going to put five more in. I'm going to feel good about finishing out July. Halloween will have $85. And that is just for any little food crafts I use for the kids. We don't get trick-or-treaters, so that's okay. And gobble tea wobble. I like, I like these envelopes. We're going to add five more. What is today? 26. Okay. I'll probably say that each time I pull one out. And that'll be $100. So, cool. Thanksgiving. I might just pick up... I don't... You know, <laughs> I'm not really doing holidays this year, but I am prepared in case I have to. Whether it be stocking up on turkey breasts or actually hosting. I, I don't plan on hosting Christmas, but who knows? We'll see. I better get cracking if I'm going to do that, right? Look, this is only has $55. And I did kind of do this off camera yesterday to get caught up. And um, so that feels good to get that done. Valentine's Day, you know, that was a national holiday. It's my husband's birthday. I think he was in the hospital. So what did I give him? I gave him money. I just, you know, I guess I had cash laying around. <laughs> Don't tell anybody. $100. I probably gave, about, gave it out of the birthday money. So we'll just keep adding to this um, for the next national holiday of Valentine's Day because my husband certainly thinks it is, as it is his birthday. And you all know that. Easter, did not, we did not use Easter. Easter, we were busy. He was probably in the hospital again. And what put him in the hospital is mostly the meds that he was on to treat the condition. He's super sensitive. He's really a big man, but he's super sensitive and delicate when it comes to medication. And they were jacking him up. So Mother's Day, he just 
I'm just going to save it. How's that? We won't even talk about it. I'll just save it. I'll spend it on something I want. Don't tell anybody. Okay, plus five. That'll give us 200, and we'll be caught up. Kind of, because look, I missed a bunch of days from March. I kind of got caught up in June and July. So there's a gap. We're just going to roll with it, let the gap go. And that's fine. Father's Day. I didn't, I didn't use any of this money. We'll save it for next year. And then we'll have plenty. See, it's hard for me to pull money out of these envelopes. And I know that's what it's for. But it, dang it, it's hard. And I think this is July 4th, Memorial Day. Kind of like just summer stuff. Put five in here, and that'll give us 155. Exciting. That's fine. Plus five, and then we'll see how August goes. I'd like to at least put five dollars a month in each of these. I am trying to play catch up, but whatever we get in there, <clears throat> oh, getting all uh, dry. Whatever we get in there, we get in there, right? Cool beans. All right. That is it for this Savings Challenge Monday. Shh. Hope you all have a great rest of your week, and I will see you later on. And that's it. Okay, bye. See you later.